Okay, hey guys, um, this is a quick trying to conceive update. I know a lot of you guys have been waiting on this video, and I'm sorry it's late, but um, yeah, I've been super busy, and um, yeah, I wanted to get on here really quickly and tell you guys I'm on uh, 11 DPO, and I tested yesterday and today, and both times got a big fat negative. So, not feeling pregnant whatsoever, so I am expecting AF in a few days. Um, my chart looks super awesome, which is kind of a tease. Um, I will insert a picture of it somewhere in the beginning in the, or in, at the end or somewhere where you can see my chart. My chart looks amazing, but I've taken tests two days in a row and they're negative. And last pregnancy, I got a positive 10 DPO, so I think we're out this month. But to make this video a little less depressing, I'm going to show you some baby buys that we bought. Um, I went shopping with Lauren, um, and we went to uh, Once Upon a Child, which is a consignment store, thrift store, resale store, whatever you want to call it. And I got a few outfits because they were only a dollar. They were on clearance, so they are only a dollar. So I got this teeny tiny little newborn onesie. It's a Carter's newborn onesie. And it came with these pants. And when I bought it, I thought they matched. It's little brown pants with monkeys. I thought they matched, but looking at them, these are monkeys. And these have little paw prints on them. So I don't, I don't think that they're supposed to go together. But it does match, like as far as colors go. But uh, I didn't notice that until I got it home. So I got these little pants. Kind of boyish, but I figured if uh, we have a girl, you can always just throw a brown headband on with it, and it would be super cute. Got that. And I also got this little outfit. It's just a newborn uh, sleeper type thing with buttons. And I'm in love with polka dots, and I figured this was pretty gender neutral. And it's only a dollar, so I couldn't pass it up. But I'm really upset because... Um, they re-tag things before they sell them, and where they had the tag, there's a little hole in the collar, which makes me very, very sad. But I guess once the baby's actually in there, their head will c cover it up, but for a dollar, you can't really beat that. So I was kind of sad that it had a hole in it, but I'm not super cute, and it came with this little hat. Although, I highly doubt that any of our children will be able to fit in it, because Jaden had a ginormous head, and this thing is super tiny. So I doubt it will ever fit fit our children, but it came with a matching hat. And I got this little um, sleeping bag thing. It's preemie size, but I think it looks about the same size as the Carter newborn onesie. <sighs> How cute it is. But it was only a dollar, so I just had to get it because I love polka dots, and I thought it was really, really cute. And it's got the little, um, little glove things on the sleeves. And, and it's it's a gown, so I figured if the baby was too long, if their feet hung out, that would be okay. And it'd be good, at least for like in at the birthing center or something, right, right when the baby's born. I figured it would fit. And for a dollar, I couldn't pass it up. So we got that. And then Baby Legs was having a sale on their website, and um, I got $80 worth of Baby Legs for $20. So they were all 75% off, so I'll show you what I got. There wasn't a very good selection, and so I'll show you the ones I picked out. These both are newborn, so I figured um, those could go on a boy or a girl. And then here's a green pair that, that are the full size. Here are tiger striped ones, which we, I am at least a big Bengals fan, Cincinnati Bengals fan. So, um... This will look really cute with like a bingle onesie or like a little bingle jersey with these on. It's going to be super, super cute. So I had to get those ones. And then I needed to spend more money to get the 75% off. So I went, I let Thomas <laughs> choose the other ones. And these are the three that he chose. He chose this black one with the little bones. Um, kind of boyish, but I figured if it's a little girl, then she could get like a little skull onesie or something and then wear a black tutu with it with a black bow in her hair and I thought that would be really cute so and then he chose these two which I think this one looks kind of Christmassy it was kind of uh, designed to be Christmassy but he liked it so he picked those and those 
so I got all these baby legs for $20. So that was a really good deal. Alright, that's it. Um, I'll insert a picture of my chart and I will talk to you guys later once, um, probably once AF arrives. Alright, I will talk to you guys later. Bye!